Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Trilogy Games. We are going to be playing a new game, uh, Grounded. Uh, well, it's not a new game, but it's fairly new compared to my other games that I've played. Um, I have played this game before, but I want to start a brand new game. As you see here, I'm going to start from the beginning. Uh, but yeah, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to be playing on woe mode just so it's a little bit more challenging for me to get stuff, certain stuff. Um, it's... Ho hopefully we can get it uh, finished as soon as possible. I will do some grinding in the background as well just to make life a little easier. Um, I'll, keep, I'll keep you guys updated every now and here. Um, yeah, let's get into the video. Okay, well, uh, yeah... We if anyone wants to know, this is how you change it. What's creatures with bugs? Zero stress. Oh, okay. Yeah, we're doing white mode because we are we are pros here. Hey, nice to meet you. Hmm. The name's Max. Hey, I'm with. What's the I like worst Max thing the best. Happen? Yep, that's my name. My name's Peter. My friends hmm. call me Pete. Ali, whoop. I'm gonna Actually, do. I'm gonna I do don't Max. recommend thinking about that. Yeah, let's do this. All right. Let's do, let's do Trilogy Games. Let's do this. I hope you're all having a lovely day as well. Uh, yeah, at any point in the video, you decide to like it, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and yeah, let's, let's get into this. Today is October 20, 1990. This is your news. We have a special breaking report. The police department has released information that more local teenagers have gone missing. They were last seen earlier this week, and the only connection between the teenagers is that they are all students at Brook Hollow High School. This could be linked to the disturbing trend of other possible abductions and missing teenagers from our otherwise quiet town. If anyone has seen the teenagers or has any other information, Please contact the police department. The mayor of Brook Hollow has put a curfew into effect for anyone under 18 starting tonight. Now to other news. In the business world, ominous practical technology signs a new year. Those roots? Nah, <laughs> can't be. This must be one of those those prank TV shows. <laughs> All right, be cool, Max. You're gonna be famous. All right. No, no, no. This isn't looking good. Nice. All right. Well, we Whoa, gotta go with peeping now. Honestly, I'm just glad it's not big enough to squish. Gotta stop peeping. Ayo, Ayo, no, 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 no. 
Do not even try me. <laughs> ah, always fun. Cool. All right. Now we're gonna beat the shit out of this weevil. No, don't run away. Wow, I didn't know that drained so much stamina. <laughs> Alright, here we go. We're going to just start collecting a bunch of stuff. We're not going to kill the ants yet, because they're a little bit tricky when you don't have a good weapon. Ooh. What was that? Some sort of radio signal? I wonder where it's coming from. Okay. We got the ball. Ooh, mushrooms. Great. I'm going to just eat all of this, and I'm going to keep one. So I can research it. And yes, for people who are wondering, uh, yep, it is one mode, and um, I don't really know where I'm going to have my base, but I think for the time being, I just want to focus on mainly the story mode. Um, yeah, a lot of, um, I know, like, the amount of times that I've played this, I've kind of jumped ahead because I'm just I'm good like that no. <laughs> I just like I know where pretty much everything is what to do in the game you know um, so it's 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 pretty good I I really enjoy grounded I played around about like 400 uh, I'm just gonna get like 30 of these plant fibers just so I have enough so I don't have to like keep going back and forth, back and forth. I'm gonna collect like 10 of these or something. Okay, um, and a few more of these rocks. Okay, cool. Collect 20 rocks. Yeah, no normally I would do this just because it's, I feel like it's gonna help me. Just, just a little bit. Um. But yeah, we're going to get some more rocks. We're just going to get 20 rocks for the time being. Just because um, once you get rocks and you start getting all that stuff, you can start like building a lot. Yeah. Ooh. Okay. Well, if anyone wants to read this, like what, what I mean by I've played this game before, like I've read all of this. I know what all of this is about and I haven't actually finished the game. So I thought I would want to try and do this before. Uh, I finished the game just so you can get my honest review of it. But I've gotten like up real close to the ending, well, I think. Someone had to have set up all this sciencey stuff. Yeah. Right? So pretty much, I got up to the shed. So I'm not exactly sure where this is and what is going on. Okay, I should um, keep looking around. You got to get those first. Those are like the first things that you got to get. I'll get one of those just so I can right craft it. Always carry multiple spears. Spears are like your best friend. Um, all right, let me go here. So my la my layout that I normally have is I have health here. I have food, something in there. Uh, health. So I have spear. I mean, um, I have axe, hammer, stabby weapon, heavy, or bow, and then heavy, and then I have, like, um, food, water, and then smoothies. That's normally how I, I do it, but, you know, go, gotta wait. <laughs> yeah, now that we have an axe, it will make life a lot easier, and we are on low mode, because I gotta do things a little extra. What is that? Okay, I'm just gonna top up now. Okay, here we go. Guess just getting three more of these. What I wanna do is I just wanna get um some clover armor as well. Just to make life a little easier. 
So yeah, what I what I normally do is when we come over here, I build like a little base here, just have like the lean to and just like some small stuff, not like too big. Heal, all right. See, I need to make ones. I need to get a lot. And I, I am trying to collect weevils just so I can get weevil meat. I mean the weevil shield. Okay. All right. We'll do this. Nothing happened. Looks like the other two lasers are blocked. After all that build up, this big mysterious computer doesn't do anything. Man. Okay. Yeah. Don't forget this, by the way. I was a fool to have ever doubted myself. A fool like Klein, like Kaminsky, like Schmetter, like all of Ominent. I am here in the backyard. Down in the backyard. I mean, I am speaking to you from the backyard. I am tiny! I should gather my thoughts. This is a momentous occasion. Wendell Tolley official log, 89.08.05. Recording as I take my first steps into the miniature world. The sights are unbelievable. The textures, the, the way the light falls upon every surface, the subtle patterns in all of the objects that surround me, the grass. Even common lawn grass looks like a structure from an alien world. Wait. What's that sound? The very earth is trembling. Over there, what could it be? An ant! My god, today the world has changed forever! Yes, they are. Okay, we're just gonna move stuff there. We're gonna get rid of that and get rid of that. I don't like the um, keys that they put on there, so I, I like to have my own set. So, I must say, I like these. They're really cute. And I like the look of them as well. Like, they're like aesthetically pleasing. If you will. I don't know, I just think they uh I'm not cute. picky. Alright. Alright, let's 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 have a look here, shall we? Um we're gonna do sap just so we can get band aids and torches and all that kind of stuff. Yeah, we're gonna leave these here because we need to research those as well. And I don't particularly feel like going all the way around looking for them. But yeah, what we need now is a torch. We need yep, we need dried grass. Okay. Cool. Only two pieces? <gasps> Normally they give you like three. No. Alright. Okie dokie, here we go. Unless I'm just like missing one piece. No, that's fine. Alright, well, we need a torch anyway, so. What we're gonna do is, I think. We're going to make the remainder of those. Um, and what we're going to do is we're going we're gonna to start making some of this as well. But before we do that, we can't actually make it until we have... Um, what you might call it? This researched. So, i got to wait for that to get over there. But what I can do for the time being is throw that apparently. Uh, but what we're going to do is we're going to do this, and we're going to use the torch, and we're going to go to the other laser. The speedy little green corn pup. Where is he? Come here, you little green sausage. Yeah, where is the green sausage? I need him. Is that Nat drunk or something? It's coming right at me. I'm trying to find it, because i got to kill them as well, so I can make shoes. All right, here we go. Did it like fall wrongly? There we go. I got to reset that as well. But yeah. Um. So that's where it is. 
I, I always try and get two of those because then I can make the aphid slippers. Don't forget that you can throw spears and lose them in the process. The amount of times that I have thrown a spear and I have actually lost the spear. It, like, especially when you've had, like, a upgraded, fully upgraded spear level, like, oh, it just, it hurts your soul when you throw it and it just disappears. They really need to fix that. <laughs> Um, 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 okay, we're over here. Okay, Mike. Okay. Okie dokie. Looks like that little red thing is in for a fight. All right, here we go. We're going inside now. Actually, All right, you know what? Shadows. Where are you? you hey, come on. Three hits. Okay. I always try and count how many hits it takes. Okay. Because there's like no point in continuously trying to beat the shit out of it. I need to crack these rocks. Don't quite understand what's in here, or I keep forgetting every time I play this game, but I'm just gonna collect as many rocks as I can. Just to make a lot like my life a little easier, ball. Okay, here we go. Oh, I thought that what was something. Heck? Is something burrowing under there? Ooh. Gabby, additional flavor scheme available. I'm just gonna grab. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna grab all of them. Yeah, I need to come back and get these. But yeah, we need to get a shovel so we can unbury those, so we can get a shield. But we're going in that direction anyways now, so I'm gonna just put this so you can actually see everything. What I might do is I might just see if maybe, see if uh, I can turn the, um, oh, I thought maybe there was some other ones. Yeah, there's a clay, we got to get that as well. Um, and then, yeah, hopefully we can start actually collecting some of the stuff. I think you can harvest this, but I'm not too sure. You need, you need level two. Yeah, unfortunately, I'm nowhere near getting that so far, so. I gotta kill a bunch of stuff. There's just so many weevils here, it's great. Oh, another one. I, I never not try and kill them because I want that, uh. What you call it? The. Uh, Oh my gosh, I forgot what it was called. Um, the golden cards. Yeah. Because if you can get those, it's going to help us out quite a lot. Yeah, so right now we've got that. We've done all of that. Uh, yeah, now we need to go get some acorns. We have a hammer for it. We've got spears in case we need to. Yeah. And also with the pebble hammer, easy as... When it comes to killing the ladybugs, I'm joking. <laughs> Something that sounded like a big far off explosion? <laughs> no. Also, you would think if there was an explosion or you heard an explosion, uh, the people inside the house would try, you know, at least tr attempt to see what the hell is going inside. Unless the house is abandoned, then I guess you can't, but I don't think the house is abandoned. No! Alright, we gotta, we gotta get that. 
tastes good. Yeah. Gotta get, we definitely have to get ourselves a water bowl as well. Just to save our asses. Because it is becoming a little bit crazy. Actually, I gotta see. Oh, I can make Lady one. Yay. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, where? Let's see. I see you. There we go. Mm. Okay, what we're gonna do is uh, uh. definitely gonna be making a workbench. One of these. Yeah, we've got plenty. What we're gonna do is we're gonna do it over there. So we can get everything. A, a lot of uh, a lot of the times when I'm playing a game and stuff, what I'm gonna do Let's see, craft a band-aid. Nah, I won't I won't do that yet. I need more sap. You gotta be careful here as well, because for any new players there are spiders around. So yeah, you, you just gotta be careful. Gotta gotta know where you're going, you know? So for instance always always collect those. Gotta eat that as well. Um, what we're gonna do is we're just gonna make a fire quickly so we can put some of the food on. Yeah, I'll, sh I'll show you where I normally put the base. Like, it's not a big base, it's just ones that have like every, like, you know, everything in it that you kind of need. So it's a golden molar, oh, not a golden one, just a normal molar down there. What I might do is just get the water in here, because there's, there's always water here when you first start. And then, gradually over time, there's barely any. Yeah, I'm in a can, <laughs> and it's pretty grand. I, it is. I, I don't know something about the soda. Um, uh, shake it, shake it up, and it... <laughs> uh, and a little fact, if you put a water collector over here... Uh, you can actually collect a lot of juice. And I, normally, if I see any of these ones, and they have ones that are like this, I normally put one on there. Okay, normally I'll just... My OCD is going to kill me if I don't put it on correctly. There. And then... And then we need a lean to, but we can't get that yet. We're gonna. Oh, it's getting dark. Should probably find somewhere to crash. Okay. Here we go. I would definitely harvest you, but you know. Alright, here we go. Yeah, we need eight ones. The more acorns. Yeah, the more acorns we collect, the better. Cause okay, I'm just staying there. Trying to just get the uh, extra parts, if you will. Yeah, there's so many, like, this is a great place when you want to get food and stuff. This is why I think this is a really good place to start off first. Okay, uh, let's see how much storage we have. Not that much. Alright, uh, what we're going to do is we can always get more weevils. So what I think we're gonna do is we're gonna get we're gonna get sprigs. And then yeah, once we get sprigs, uh, we can finally put some meat on and then we don't have to waste all that meat. And then we can also get a shovel, which is gonna just help us out a bunch. Hopefully. Yeah, hopefully we do that soon, because, uh, I, I, w I don't want the food to spoil, because, especially in woe mode, it runs out so quickly. Alright, there we go. 
Okay, we're gonna go back. Gonna gonna do this shit, and then yeah. Hopefully we can get a lane too, because I am very surprised that we did not get one. Um, we'll put those on, because I think you need four. Do you need? I don't even know how many you need. Yeah, definitely making that. You need four. Yeah, you need four of them. And now that we have this, and five. We can go harvest them. And I always, and I like to play in third person by the way, just FYI. I just thought for the first. Having a marking a location. Spotted you. There we go. Nice and gooey, I think. Okay, there was definitely one over here, right? Am I just blind? Nah. I don't think I'm blind. Okay. Alright. I think for the time being, that should be fine to make... The weevil shield, yeah, we just need to hold it. We just need to chop some trees down or grass. We need three pieces, which is perfect because you always get three pieces from them. And yes, I will grab those in a second. Can't consume that or that. Those things are really good because they give you water, food, and health. And like, not even a small amount, like a good. Good chunk, if you will. Uh, lean to. There we go. Don't remember learning this, but alright. We're gonna put this as our reset point. And we're gonna. We are gonna put that on there. Because we have a shield now. Don't we? <gasps> Do we not have a shield? Nah, I thought we did. I thought we had a shield, didn't we? <gasps> I'm an idiot. Alright. Guess we're going to go get some weevils. Because knowing my luck, we won't run into any. <gasps> Except for that one. We need four of them. So. Should be... There should be some around there. If I'm not mistaken. They're not, like, hard to find at all. They're just... It's my luck. <laughs> There's also a stink bug here, so if you are going to come around this area, you just got to be careful because stink bugs are... Or There's one stink bug around here. And that's why I like to go there, especially you know, at the beginning. It's good luck to see a firefly. It is? Okay, well. Guess we see one. Um... Yeah, we got to go and get a shield, because as soon as we get a shield, I'm more than comfortable fighting different creatures and different things. Alright, here we go. The reason I'm collecting those as well is so I can make a water canteen. Big spider. Yeah, right now I don't want to deal with those. Come on, weevils. I don't want to stray too far. Oh no, is this where they are? There, there, there we go. Oh, thank gosh. Alright. Yeah, we got a nose. You know what? I'm going to try and research that stuff as well. Um, but we're going to go to the oak tree explosion after we get shield, obviously, because I'm not fighting or going near anything until we do that. So, yeah. Let's go through here. I know it seems dark, but it should be fine. Alright. Then we're gonna go through here. 
Yeah, and then once we go to the base, it's going to be a lot better. Okay. Well, I've just collected a bunch of shit. So, that's going to help us quite a bit. Um... Yeah, like I said, I I actually forgot to hit record or unpause. So as you see, I've just collected a bunch of stuff. Um, yeah, so we can make a shield now, which I am very happy about. And now we can also make the <gasps> lippers, which I am very happy about. So now I'll not only up. can we equip all of that get one of those as well because yeah this stays full for longer helps out quite a lot what we're gonna do is I'm gonna wait for 430 around yeah, okay can we make a water canteen we need oh, of course we do um we need yeah we need to get more we'll just get some of these um, okay here we go. There. There. We might just go around there, see if we can get something. I love these aphid slippers, man. They make you run so they make you like run so fast. Especially when you have natural explorer on. Ooh. Like a speed demon. I can't wait to get that, so. And those are mutations, if anyone didn't know. If this is your first time playing it, it's I recommend playing it. I'll leave a link down it's below because it's on it's a Steam game, so. Or Xbox game if you will. But yeah, if you guys haven't played it, definitely play it. I recommend it. Take that, vampires! <laughs> okay. Um we are gonna go get the water or the juice box. This looks like juice. Oh, where did the juice come from? Hmm. Okay, what we're gonna do? Let's space out plenty. If we find any, I'm gonna also get some of the um, clay, just to make life a little easier. There we go. There we go. I'm not picky. That was the wrong button. God damn it. Um alright. Let's let us go back. Okay, well, we are definitely back. Um yeah, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go there, we're gonna get ourselves a um thing in bob. A canteen and we're gonna make a band-aid just because it says that we need to make one and we're gonna sleep I must say I prefer the sleeping animation to the one that we used to have where it was just like sped up <laughs> also food will rot you can't just leave it on here anymore so as you see, it's it's unfortunate, but we have to do it. <laughs> um, yeah, so what we're going to do now for today's mission is go to the oak tree. See what that's about. See what we can do. What we have to do. What we need to do. And then... Yeah, I think after that, uh, I need to go make a bow, because uh, as much as a sprig bow is not the best, we need it for the beginning, 100%. I cannot kill anything, spider, nothing, until we get that. Okay, I'll keep quiet, please. I have isolated the source of the particle irregularities. They appear to be a byproduct of the shrinking process. 
If I adjust the machine to account for their existence, it should be the key to the de-shrinking, uh, expanding process. Burgle, please bring up the readings for the irregular covalent SNPI 42Z particle traces. Ugh, that name is going to get tiresome. And while you're at it, rename all references to the irregular covalent SNPI 42Z particle to raw science. Order received. Raw science identified. Does it require cooking, flipping, or g, -g, -g grilling No, 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 none of those. Categorization. That answer is not permitted, according to health code standards governing the handling of raw food items. Yeah, if you guys want to read this, you can. Okay, can't get in there yet. Ooh, burgle. I'll go get the r r r r r raw science. Let's do this. Never told me science could be this exciting. Well, now you know. Ain't that right, Max? Can we? Yeah, we can. Hey, we ha we have to go talk to Burkle, but thought I'd just uh, collect some stuff just while we're here. Let's also, see what's around here. The hamster. I think that hamster's the one that's in the grave area. One success after another! I have returned Burgle to his original size! It appears that my new raw science containment field is working at 99% effectiveness. 98.5%. Let's do this. Right, Burgle, right. However, as Burgle indicates, there is some minor insignificant raw science leakage. A note for another time. Thanks for the helping hand! Yeah, no worries, Burgle. Burgle, hmm? acting science manager for this project. I am also a robot. <laughs> I am sure this all must be very disorienting for you, but hopefully I can explain. Okay, we'll go talk to Bert. Um, actually, no, we'll go get this so you can hear it. Transcription unit 87.9.5. Order number one. Robot, I need you to monitor these power fluctuations and inform me if they exceed acceptable limits. Hello, my name is Burgle and I will be serving you today. I specialize in cooking, flipping, and g -g grilling. Grilling? A feature useful only to your obsolete burger flipping brethren now consigned to the scrap heap? I need you to monitor these readings. Burgle. And isn't it redundant to specialize in cooking and grilling? Understood. Appending monitor power fluctuations to my prime directive list. Deprioritizing grilling. Good. Now get on with it. Reprioritizing cool. grilling. That's so cool. I I I remember when I was first playing this when the demo came out, they never had this thing it was always just a black screen, but now you can actually see the different type of hedges, or the different type of labs. Sorry. I am sure this all must be very disorienting for you, but hopefully I can explain. I suspect you were miniaturized by Doctor Tully's spacer device. Why are you here in the yard? I do not know. In fact, I cannot seem to recall much of anything. A recent power surge has caused a massive raw science containment explosion. This lab, as you can see, is a disaster. And what's worse, the explosion has disrupted my computing power. My memory banks are corrupted. Sorry to pile on the bad news, my new friend. How can I be of service? You are here, in the Oak Lab. Built and used by Dr. Wendell Tatelli to experiment on all things small- all things small. This is the base of operations for conducting experiments in his yard. Dr. Tully is a brilliant scientist and inventor. He is also my creator. My initial protocol was to serve as the short order cook of the future. Okay. However, I have been recently promoted to acting science manager to assist with his experiments. No doubt my previous work experience has been invaluable to Dr. Tully. Although, now that I am processing it, I have not seen him for several weeks. And now I cannot recall where he went. It must be my c c corrupted memory banks. It seems you and I are both a little discombobulated. <laughs> Given my best calculations, 
Your biomass has been subject to covalent spacing reduction via interatomic energy extraction. In other words, you have been shrunk. It is likely this was achieved using Dr. Wendell Tully's Spacer platform, patent pending. Shrinking can be a traumatic experience for tiny human brains, <laughs> and memory loss is a known side effect. Hopefully your memory will return in time. To return to your prior size, you would need to successfully activate Dr. Tully's Spacer platform. Unfortunately, my readings indicate it is inoperable. It appears to have suffered several malfunctions from the explosion. I am sorry, but it appears you may be stranded here for some time until we find a solution. Haha! <laughs> that is a great idea! Let me run a full diagnostic scan on it and see what we need to do to get it fixed up. Processing! Processing! <laughs> Memory fault! Code 408B3000! ARG! I am sorry again. It appears I have sustained more damage to my memory chips than expected. Without yeah. those memories, I do not know how to repair these face- Dr. Tully used two types of chips to back up my memory. Auxiliary chips are small capacity chips used to store project data. If you find these, I should be able to help you learn new survival recipes. Super chips are special, and they are gold! They back up full directories of my memory system. If we are going to fix the spacer, that data is bound to be on a super chip. I yeah. suggest exploring the other labs in the backyard. Rip Dr. Are. Tully has built many more labs throughout the yard. Each lab is used for various experimental procedures. I can upload their locations to your scabby. Processing. Error. Yeah, so cheese and are. fries. The lab locations are missing from my memory banks too, but we are in luck. I was able to retrieve the location of one of the facilities, the Hedge Lab. The Hedge Lab is the observation center of the yard and used for research on arachnid webbing. You will find the hedge near the house if you head southeast. The lab is located deep inside the hedge, sending the coordinates to your scabby. Try to find the Hedge Lab first, but there is nothing stopping you from searching the yard for the other labs. Except, of course, thousands of angry, hungry insects. <laughs> that reminds me. Dr. Tully locks the important labs with biometric scanners. You will need access for any chance of success. Head over to the ASL terminal and place your hand on the biometric scanner near it. Give it a moment to sync your signature into the mainframe. Once you are registered, you will be granted access to the ASL network of computers, too. ASL grants access to daily work items. Nay, tasks. Nay, quests. Yes, quests. I will reward you raw science for each completed quest. In nice. my science shop, you can trade raw science back for survival recipes from experiments that Wendell conducted when he was first exploring the yard. Log on to the ASL terminal over there. Yeah. And right, we'll unless you have any other questions, you nah. really should get have an exponentially great day. You too, Burgle. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go scan this. What we're gonna do is we're going to. There was a door back there as well. I can't actually get anything in there, but yeah, the these are important to get because you get um like tokens from them. I'm 100% getting the smithing station. Like there is no doubt I am not getting that cook the cookery as well. Yeah, I'm getting that. Sorry, sorry, not sorry. You you always got to get the cookery. But um, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go over here. And what I think we're gonna do is we're gonna do the hedge. But we're gonna do that next episode because we are running low. And I see that we don't have a lot of um, water. This morning I installed the borrowed lab modules. Another one of my here. forgotten inventions from the early days. I had such grand notions back then. The Kinder Science Mini Quick Little Chemist Lab Educational Tool for Children. But no, Wendell, we can't possibly put hydrochloric acid into the hands of children. The lawyers will never agree. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good thing I never told them about the Bunsen burners. Odd that Ominent has been using my toy pieces in this way. Hmm. I digress. The lab network is now up and running in the backyard. 
I'm planning to dedicate We're each dying. one of them to a different function. The main power will run through here, the Oak Lab, as the center of operations for the backyard. The second lab is nestled into the hedge. Such wonderful views from up there. Side note, I'm worried that Ominent's shoddy manufacturing of the lab pieces will cause them to fall apart over time, but they will do for now. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're gonna try and get some water. Best as we can. We're gonna just... Yeah, if you're ever dying and you are around this area, go over there because you get so many different things. I'm gonna drink this. And then I'm gonna go over there, see if we can find any. I'm gonna try and fill this water bottle thing up. Because as soon as we can do that, we can start heading over to the hedge. Um. Okay. Yeah, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go. Oh, I've gotta clean up this as well. Um. What I might do is. I might just wait a little bit. See what I can do. Uh, see if maybe I can. Um. Build some more stuff here. So, yeah. Obviously, I'm not gonna build these things yet. Like the. Um. cookery and stuff, but yeah, so what we're gonna do is we need to get, we need to get that spig bro, spig bro, sorry, because once we get that, it's gonna help us out heaps, and also we need to, we need to get these, because then we can finally get the crafting station, as you see here, we have a lot that we can, like, make, so there's the smithy over here, Okay. Okay, we're gonna do that. And yeah, we need one of each. But I think for the time being, I'll eat that. And then la, 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 we'll put one of these here. Just so we can, like, store stuff. We're gonna just put everything in here. Everything that's pretty much learnt, we'll put in here. We'll put that in there. Cause then, yeah, we're we're gonna we're gonna have to try and learn these as well. And there's like an order that I normally put these in. So what I'm what I'm gonna do is do that now, just to show everyone. So yeah, normally I have my two weapons here, have my two things there, and I have my utilities over here. And then, normally, I have my things over here, and I put my arrows over here. Normally I just fill these three up, because then I have all of this space left. And I'm excited for the next update, because then we get an extra ten slots, which I am over the moon about. So, yeah, what we're going to do now is just going to go get some water, we're going to actually try and survive. <laughs> um, but first, before we do that, oh, okay, so clearly we haven't researched that, yeah, we haven't. Alright, uh, yeah, we're going to go get some water, we're going to try, uh, we might actually go over there, because we need to kill some gnats, because we need to get that bow. As soon as we get that bow, then we can, like, get a lot more stuff, because... The, have a look um, there's like a thorn bush over there where we can get the thorns and stuff, so that's going to be fine for us. Um, also, when we get over there, um, we can unlock some stuff, as Burgle said as well, so as soon as we can <laughs> do all of these... The okay, what we're going to do... Okay. Okay, you know what? We we can fight. No. Why are you running? Oh, you sly bastard. Stop. 
Stop running away from me. There we go. Yeah, that is the one thing that I can say is pretty stupid. That you don't get a lot of stuff. Yeah, we need to get some more red ant armor as well. Like, oh, there's just so much that we need to do. We need to farm. Gotta get a lot of stuff done. But yeah, I'll definitely do a lot of grinding in the background as well. Just so we can speed up the process, because, yeah, there's just so many things. Like, we gotta kill that thing, we gotta... There's, like, a brood mother. there's, I think, four bosses? Or five? No, five bosses. But there's three insects that are bosses. Um, or, actually, I, honestly, I don't even know at this point, but I know that there's a lot of boss insects, not just, like, in arenas and stuff, but there is, uh, there's the Black Widow, there's, uh, Broodmother, I think the Moth counts as one as well, because it's got, like, a lot of health, um, the Mant, because that's, I, I count that as an insect, um, and then there's also... Uh, that, the mant, the mantis, termite king, there's, like I said, there's so many that it's just, it's hard to keep count. But yeah, what we're gonna do, is since we're here, we're gonna collect some thorns. Yeah, cause these, you need, this is how you make arrows, you need thorns. I remember they were also gonna say they were gonna bring out, like, these different type of thorns. Like, um... Ones that had like better arrows and all that stuff, or just like better thorns in general on the rose bushes, which I think would have been pretty cool. Even if you had to like use a, an actual like axe and they didn't like respawn straight away, you know what I mean? I think that would have been pretty sick. And the thorns would have been like super gigantic and you had to use them for like building or something, that would have even been fine. I just think that they look a little bit weird. Like, can you imagine having these bushes around here and they didn't have thorns in them? Like, can you imagine that? Like, how stupid that would look. Yeah, that's how that's how they look. <laughs> um. Okay. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go over here. Okay. Get the shit out of this red ant. And then what we're gonna do? There we go. Where are you? We're gonna... Because this is the best place over here on the map. In my opinion, this is the best area to get these mites. Also, that sound is very, very bad. I do not like it at all. Is this a lava around? My gosh, there are so many. Where are you off to, Ant? Did you see that? I'm not picky. Okay. Now we're gonna go around. Yeah, be careful as well when you're over here, because there is a um a wool spider that normally sleeps Let's see in what's here. I see you. I'm not qualified to fight him yet until I get a bow. So yeah, what we're gonna do? Oh, actually, yeah, great, great, great spot. We're gonna go get this rotten lava blade. I know it might not sound exciting, but it's pretty good. Also, you're gonna want to try and get it early as possible because if you don't get them early, um, if I'm not mistaken, they actually do, uh, like I wouldn't say rot, but they do. Oh, I forgot what that was called, the... Uh... Um... They do like... The... Oh my gosh, I forgot what the word was called. I do not know how this is possible. I previously 
honestly believe that all the parts of my functional unit were required for operation. But apparently yeah. they were not. Perhaps that means I have some extra storage space. <laughs> Very philosophical. Do you feel anything else? No, everything appears to be the same. Oh, I have come to realize that this world is absolutely covered in hell. It's quite concerning. You may wish to wash your hands before returning to work. Come on. I'm gonna die. That's why I like the lava bite, because it does that. I don't want any trouble in. Okay, no, we're, we're done. <laughs> we are done. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're gonna try and go back that direction. Because if I'm not mistaken, that direction is where. Actually, do we have a band aid? Yes, we do. Thank gosh. Uh, yeah, what we're gonna do is we're gonna have a great time getting some gnats. Because, we, yeah, we, we have to go over there. Um. Honestly, I don't even remember the last time I actually got some gnats. Like, uh, I think, yeah, I think pretty much once you get the bow, you don't even, I, I, I barely need them anymore, so I know we just scrap them afterwards. Unless you're doing something else, which I'm not 100% sure. But yeah, what we're going to do is we're going to collect these. you got to find all of these as well. I've thought about this in circles for days now, and I've come to a decision. It's time to restart spacer development. Almanid may not believe in it, but I know its potential. Though I must figure out how to return shrunk objects to their original size. The first step will be to address the particle transcription errors. Yeah, it seems almost that certain that the irregularities are responsible for the failure during the demonstration. Burgle, please bring up all the lab data about the unknown particles. Happy to be of service. Notes will be prepared and delivered to your table in four hours or less. Four hours? What are the chances for less? Delivery estimate will be prepared in two hours or less. An auspicious beginning. Yeah. What we're gonna do as well is since we're here, we might as well just get the coup de grass as well. So then we can finally, finally start getting some of the the delicious perks. So yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go there as well today, because yeah. Like I said, we are in woe mode, which is a lot harder than the other ones, so I wanna wanna get as much as I can done. It's alright. I think it's it's actually over there, yeah. Yeah, if you ever want to find it, it's... No, it's not this one. It's here. I think it's over here, if I'm not mistaken. Actually, no, I think it's backwards. Yeah. Oh, what the hell was that? Actually, I think it is back over here, if I'm not mistaken. It's not this one, but I'm fairly sure it is back over here. No? No. Don't get me wrong, it is somewhere over here, I just, I lost where it was. Oh, hang on. I think we got a winner. I think it's over here. Yeah, it is. So yeah, if you ever want to figure out where it is, because there's a hole over here, as you see down here. Yeah. So yeah, this is where it is in the map. If you want to 
onto this location. It's like kind of, kind of triangle to these two. Yeah, if you come over here, that's where it is. Okay, so we're gonna dive down, but before we do that, uh, I just want to check something. All right. Um. Okay, good. Let's go, let's go down. And there is a scab here as well, which I will get. Okay, there we go. Let me just go up here. Look at that. The crude grass. And there's Brit's Quartz, which is great. This is the ones that we need to make the smithy. Okay, um, I need the torch. Flash. That would have hurt. Okay. Gonna get some of this as well. You know, as soon as we get the yeah, there's the level three and the level three. Normally, there's a I think there's also a level two, but I just don't know where it is. Or is it only level three there? Yeah, yeah, it's only level three. All right, well we're gonna go back up. All right, I'm just gonna grab the spear just because it's a lot easier to use. Wait, can you use this? No, you can't. You can only use a spear. Let's see. So there's only certain weapons that you can use in, like, while you're diving and when you're playing and stuff, so. Alright. Okay, don't go, okay, don't go that way then. <laughs> Woo, alright. Shield. Okay, we're gonna go... We're gonna go to the field station over here. And we're going to drink that water. This is what I mean by, like, the water. It just goes down so quickly. That's why I like wearing the this kind of armor. Uh, in normal games, I would kind of just, like, toss it. Wouldn't even bother with it. But, like, I'd normally just go straight to the red armor. Okay. Um, and then, I think... What do. I mean, we have to do all of them anyway, but trying to just do priorities over anything. <laughs> Alright. But our main goal today was to actually try and get some. What you call it? Trash pebble. We're gonna get some gnats, because we need them. I'm not leaving until we get it. I know it's night time and I hate it out here, but gotta do what you gotta do. Oh my gosh, there's like normally thousands of gnats around. There we go. Unless they're like sleeping. But I doubt that. <gasps> I know where they're gnats. By the light. I just gotta be careful here because there's a bombardier beetle. You can actually hear it. Yeah, you just gotta be careful because that bombardier beetle can pretty much one shot you. Yeah, I think when I was playing this, the bombardier beetle actually did kill me. One hit. No joke. <laughs> there's that stupid thing, bug. I see you. Uh, that's the problem with the stink bugs. They're just so mean. Gotta get out of here as soon as I can. Come on. And there's things walking around at night, and it's just, it's unpleasant. Okay, well, I guess we're not going that way. We're gonna go up here. 
Yeah, there we go. There's always gnats around the light. Like, there are hundreds of gnats, as you can see, in the air. And yes, I will be using this fang thing, because... Dagger. Okay. Oh. Well, that was no fun. Alright. We're gonna do long range. Kind of long range. <laughs> got six, so that should be good enough. Uh. I know, I know. Okay. And yeah, in the, I think in the next episode, um, I'll probably have built quite a lot already. Um, yeah, next episode we're going to the hedge. I'm gonna build some tree saps as well, so we can get a lot of sap. Um, I'm just gonna do a lot of grinding on this. It is only in the morning right now, it's 9.30, but, yeah, I got stuff to do, got places to be, um, but yeah, uh, I think after this, yeah, there we go, I'm gonna put the, I'm gonna put these in there as well, and that, cause that's gonna help, and obviously those, Like I said, we're gonna put everything in there, and then we're gonna do that. We're gonna hmm. eat some food. Damn! Give me a plate eat of these. these. Yeah. Okay. What we're gonna do is we can make five of each. So. Okay. Uh, we're gonna research those two, and then we're gonna go sleep. Well, actually, we're gonna sleep, and then we're gonna research. Just to make our lives a little easier. Because we got food on there, I got a bunch of stuff there, so. For anyone wondering, like, normally the canteen for me, um, the canteen's kind of like a. Let's uh, see what's around here. Yeah, of course, there's a freaking wolf spider. Um. That's my alarm. Okay, we're gonna. Yeah, we need sprigs. Yeah. As you see, we are going to go get some sprigs. And then once we've done that, we will end it. Because then we can get a bow. And then I'm going to just do a bunch of stuff by myself. Hopefully everything goes right. Um, and I think in the next episode, we're going to try and go get some... Um, more insects, like the bomber beetle. We're going we're gonna to try and do a lot of that stuff, because... Like I said to you, I'm going to do a lot of grinding, um, I'm going to try and get some of these and then I'm going to get a bunch of arrows, yeah. Like I said, I'm going to try and get a bunch more arrows, I'm going to put these in there. So right now I got, I, I normally carry 60, but when it comes to like killing the wolf spider, I am not taking any chances except for putting all the arrows in here. And then also on top of that, I have um, things to repair my bow. And I think in the next episode, I'll actually show you how I normally fight or I kill them. It's actually pretty easy. It's just cheesing them. And I can do it with a sprig bow, might I just add. It's all you need. But yeah, so I'm just gonna set, I'm gonna set this up like I normally would. And then, I'm gonna research those. And what I'm going to do is, I actually don't even need this, but I'm going to keep it just so I can research it. Oh, look at this. I, I love the look of it as well. It just looks so aesthetically pleasing. But yeah, what I'm going to do is I'm going to... 
I try and upgrade these little shoes things as much as I can because I'm I'm gonna use them. There we go. Because um, I think when you upgrade it to level six or level five, um, it just it helps you out so much because it I think it reduces the amount of speed or amount of stamina you use when sprinting. So yeah. Um, yeah, what I might do, because I have no idea what I'm doing right now, um, oh, you know what, I reckon we, I reckon I can take that out, but I'll do that in the next episode, but what I'll do is the water container thing, because water is going to be a pain in the butt, alright, here we go, Okay, uh, yeah, we need one more. Alright, and then we go get some... Some more of this. I actually think this is like... A lot of people don't really like the water collector, because it's like, not really... It doesn't have a purpose, but I found a purpose for it. It's basically, you can get an endless supply of juice. <laughs> pretty good. Obviously it takes a few days to acquire a lot of it, but if you have these things and if you make them everywhere you are, yeah, so normally have a, go a little bit further over. Yeah, just so it's like, I might just put a little bit further. Yeah, so that's going to drop it into there. It's going to save us some time from getting water all the time. Obviously, I'm going to try and get the dew catcher. Obviously, yeah, I think it, it is kind of a must-needed thing. But for the time being, we'll use that because it's going to help us out a bunch. And on top of that, I need to get a stink bug mask so we can kill stink bug because. Oh, those things are mean when you don't have one. <laughs> Not normally, what I do is I have I make a set of like, um, like these shoes mixed in with the termite armor, like chest piece, and then I'll have like that with the um, the mite hat. Just because it has hyper, like hyper stamina, it does all that kind of stuff, and it helps you out quite a lot. So, oh, and we have one, perfect. Okay, let's put that back. Yeah, probably in the next episode you'll see that there's a lot to do. But yeah, for anyone wondering, if you have enough arrows, you need a minimum of a um, hundred arrows if you want to do that. And what I like to do is as well, if you are going to do what I'm about to do, or what I'm going to do in the next episode, is get at least three spears. That's what I normally would do. I get three spears, just for the situation, or two even. And what I'll do is I'll cheese the black, uh, the wolf spider, and I'll bring him over here. And if you jump here, here, and you actually go up here, he won't be able to hit you and he doesn't do anything, he doesn't like try and jump, he doesn't do anything, he might like might walk back and forth, but other than that he won't do anything. So yeah. Thank you all for watching the video. Um yeah, it's I I, I love this game. It, it's really fun. Um Yeah, so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna try and clean up everything. I'm going to research these as well, so I'll do that in my spare time. I'll get some more stuff sorted around the um, kind of like base area. And yeah, hopefully when you come back, you'll see a big improvement. I'll build like um, like the grass walls and stuff. I'll like build them here. Just just to keep things out just in case. Because I know um, those Having little shit little and beat. things, they like to come and steal food. So yeah. Okay, well, thank you all for watching the video. I really do appreciate it. Um, yeah, let me know about, um, whether or not you want me to do stuff in the game, 
Is there certain things that maybe I don't know that you want me to check out? Um, yeah. Also, let, let me know out of all the four characters, if you do play this, let me know which ones you mostly like to play as, because, yeah, no, I, the ones I normally go with is either uh, Hoop, Max, or Peter. I've never actually played as uh, Willow, but I like I like playing as those, just because the dialogue is pretty good. Uh, I'll normally play as just those two though, because I like I like him with his weird remarks. I like how he's scared all the time. But yeah, uh, hopefully we can get a lot done. And yeah, uh, I hope I'll see you guys in the next video. Uh, thank you for watching the video. Really appreciate it. Um, I love the support that you give me. Uh, yeah, at any point in the video, you just like, like to like it, uh, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and yeah. I'll catch you guys in the next clip. Bye.